Hey, this is Jeremy Barnhart from Goldie Rock Entertainment, and we're here at the Diana Krull uh, Center, and uh, we're here for the Paint and Skate, it's August 6th, and um, we're gonna check out some of the sites and some of the stuff that's going on. Jeremy from Gully Rock Entertainment again. We're gonna check out some of the vendors. Hey guys. Hey, um, I'm Jeremy from Gully Rock Entertainment, and we were wondering if we could get a uh, any type of whatever you want to say and stuff like that. We're gonna stick it up on the web. But basically, the whole point of it is just like kind of introduce art and skating as kind of a kind of unified thing. Awesome. Yeah. Really, there's a, there's a far and, and promote that skateboarding is a positive thing, too. Yeah. Okay. But Russ is a man of Yeah. All right. Hey, Russ? Russell. This is Russ. Yeah. Oh, He's got the philosophy. They want to interview you, Russell. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How's it going? Hey, how you been? Oh, that's all right. Yeah. Yeah, hey, um, we're uh, we're basically just doing some filming. Um, this is absolutely awesome. We're really excited about this going on. So anything that you wanted to uh, <laughs> tell folks about it, uh, we want to kind of get this out there, uh, put it on our site, and uh, and hopefully kind of spread it around. Sure. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. No worries. Yeah. Um, Basically, we decided to do the paint and skate about eight months ago. Mm -hmm. I wanted to do live painting in Nanaimo. My first idea was to paint an old bus. But I thought that might have been a little bit too much. And then we came up with the idea of painting, because I skate, we came up with the idea of painting the ramp, which is obviously getting constructed right now. Uh, and then we got a whole bunch of artists on board, like people really wanted to get into it, you know? Mm -hmm. And recently we just found out that we can actually start traveling the show, so it's going to go to Vancouver, Montreal as well. Uh, yeah, so we got into it, it's a non it's a non profit thing, right? So some of the artists might want to take something to cover their supplies, but most of the actual profits are going to go to the NSA, which is the Nanaimo Skate Park Association. Uh, so we're trying to raise money because like the skate parks get pretty run down. We want to try and build new ramps there and stuff like that. So that's pretty much what the event's about. It's also the event's about you know showing people a different style of artwork that is in the Nanaimo and you know skateboarding as well. Like skateboarding's going to be great. Skateboarding's going on tomorrow. Great. Yeah. After I paint the ramps. So, yeah. Great. Um, a little bit about the artists. Like how did you how did you kind of contact people or did you put the word out and kind of spread or the magical power of Facebook? Nice. Okay. Yeah. I already knew a couple of the people, but uh, yeah, I mean. Facebook, you go on Facebook, say you're looking for artists and you get, you know, lots of people applying. We turned down a few people, like, you know, there's a few people that were really on the right track, but they, maybe their work wasn't mature enough, so hopefully they'll apply again next year, you know? Okay. So we'll be looking for submissions all the time, especially for here, right, because this is going to be the home base of the event all the time, and then we will travel it on. Great. Yeah. And have you had anybody um, from the outside, so to speak, kind of uh, give you any trouble with putting something on like this? Or no. is it honestly looked at as, as an artistic uh, yeah, endeavor? Yeah, no, like everybody's, it's been a really, really, really positive uh, reception. Obviously, the city funded most of it. Yeah. Uh, we have our um, Subaru, which is our corporate sponsor now. They're totally backing it. They're lo they're loving what we're doing. Great. Uh, I have all the skateboard sponsors that back it. But as far as the city goes, the people, everybody seems to be really into it so far. We're expecting a lot of people. So, yeah, it's been a really positive thing. You know? That's great. That's great. <laughs> um, do you, are you involved in any other skate activities in town? I mean, are there any... Um, I'm one of the members of the NSA, which is the Animal Skate Park Association, so we will try to put on as many skateboard events as possible. We don't always have to involve our work. Um, <laughs> no, I mean, other than that, I just skateboard. You know, cool. I skate in town, I've been skateboarding for a long time. Awesome. Hi, my name is Jeremy, and this yeah. is Alexis. Alexis. This is Faith. Hey. We're from Goldie Rock Entertainment, Goldie Rock Records. So, so they were doing this event, and I guess that I'm fair, you know, fairly new to the, the Vancouver Island scene. Yeah. But yeah, so they just Spencer gave me a holler some time ago, and I so I've been prepping and. 
There you go, sir. Awesome. Thank you very much. No worries. So yeah, just that's about how that happened. And so Spencer just got a hold of me and said, would you be a part of this? And I'm like, of course. So that's sweet. Um, it, it, it's it's what I what I get excited about is seeing young people who are motivated to do stuff yeah. stick their neck out. I mean, this is this is freaky to be doing this with all these people going by. No, that's an awesome old dude. I like. Funny, but at the same time, try to make a statement and whatever, yeah, yeah. And, and, and leave the uh, interpretation up to the individual. So, like, even when it comes to labeling paintings, I hate doing it because you might see something different than somebody else, but because there's a title, oh, that's what the title. So, but some people get very mad if there's not a title. So, but stuff like this, yeah, that's great. You know, it's super fast and whatever, but I, I like to be able to convey a message like that. Yeah. And it's not that this generation is illiterate, they're illiterate. They know how to read, they just don't want to, so yeah. that's, that's what that is. Do you find that there's a lot of apathy amongst, I mean, anything that actually carries weight? Yes, I mean, I hate to sit and be so crass, but it seems a lot of people, all they want is their bag of, bag of weed and Doritos. Yeah. That's it. And they'll be happy to sit on Facebook or this, that, and the other and watch other people be the artist types and they wish they could just do it. Yeah. Here's, I mean, that's why the, originally my, you know, part of the, my work, like his name is Hack Through a Nightmare. I'm just a dork who started and just kept doing it, refining, refining, and refining. And not that, you know, I'm just so excited to be here. So That's I'm nothing awesome. special. I just uh, turned off the TV and, and enjoyed life. Yeah. So that's that's where that's at. So. Love it.